questions for DJ? DJ, obviously, you know, tough day for you guys. Had a few tough days this year. How do you know you and other leaders in the locker room kind of, in the coaching staff, kind of keep everyone's heads up and keep, like, you know, from getting you down on yourself? You know, so uh, honestly, I just feel like we just gotta keep pushing, you know, keep the team together, keep the locker room together. Uh, block out all the outside noise and just, just win one and over every week. DJ, how much head scratching is going on in the locker room now after eight turnovers? You know, um, I can't even tell you, but it probably is a lot of head scratching. You know, we just gotta come back Monday, Tuesday, prepare hard uh, for the next opponent and move forward. You know, we can't just keep dwelling on, on this loss and this game. Um, it's a lot of ball ahead, so just gotta keep moving forward. DJ, when your coach says that regression showed up, how do you guys go ahead and take that as a group, knowing that you worked hard to get to this point, you had some problems, and now you're trying to get back, but now you're back to regression showing up? You just gotta, you know, you gotta really keep moving forward. You gotta keep pushing, keep pushing. I mean, there's always times where you probably fall off, you probably gonna get a little drop, but it's how you wanna climb back up to the top of the mountain. DJ, how confident are you that? that the guys in that locker room are capable of turning things around and, and heading in the positive direction? Um, I'm very confident in the group that I play with. You know, um, that was the case I wanted to be at the University of Miami. So uh, I know the guys feel the same and, and you know, it'll, it'll happen, it'll come through for us. How much did uh, Coach Cristobal have to say something? How much did you guys yourselves maybe say things to each other in the locker room afterwards? Um, after this game, um, you know, it's, it's tough. It's tough um, on Coach Chris Ball and, and what he has to say, but you know, as a as a group, um, as a defensive group, uh, we just know that we just gotta come back to work. You know, we just gotta keep pushing. Um, we fell short, and we just gotta you know, come back to work, keep pushing. One and How much is it? I guess you know, sack energy from from the defense when you guys have to be on the field so much. You know, I mean, eight turnovers. You guys are back on the field after those. You have the long drive with eighteen plays, almost or almost ten minutes, like. Did you guys, did you feel like your the team's energy, the defensive energy was coming down towards the end of the game? No, nah, I mean, that's just what we do, you know? We, we play on the defensive, defensive side of the ball for, for games like this, for, for plays like this, so I don't think it was a big deal for us, you know, to just come out and, you know, force them a field goal, force them, force them three, get a turnover, force them three and out. So that was the main mentality for the whole game. DJ, what is the, uh, what's the atmosphere like now in the locker room, very quiet. Were guys mad and talking? Were they crying? What's what's going on in there? Um, it, it obviously is a little quiet in there, but uh, you know, just gotta go around and pick everybody up, make sure everyone is on one accord, make sure everyone stays together, um, and just tone down everything else but the guys that's in the locker room, the people that, that you play with, the coach that coaches you, and we just gotta move forward, keep on. Did anybody give it? Did any of the players? Like stand up and, and talk to the other players after coach talked to you. Um, yeah, there was a, you know, a couple guys go around and you know say what they gotta say, but I don't want to name drop or nothing like that. But you know, there's 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 leaders on the team that you know try to pick up everyone on the team. You know, even out on the field during the game. So it just keep going throughout the locker room. Did you get any sense that there was a lack of effort in the fourth quarter? Did you get any sense that that some guys gave up or that that there was just a deflation toward the end of the game? Nah. Honestly, no. Um, I felt that we, we continued to play hard as defense, um, and we continued to push. Every time they got the ball, it was like, let's get three and out of field goal. That's not, that's not going to be in the end zone, honestly. You know, you've been here for a while. Like, what do you feel is breaking down? You know, what, what you know, it, it wasn't, you know, they had eight turnovers, but it wasn't just the offense. I mean, you guys gave up an 18-play drive after you had the lead. Um, you played a lot of defense. What What's not happening? Um, I think it really just comes down to the little things. Um, just missed tackle, just somebody getting out of the gap. Um, just something little, something so simple like that. You know, if you know a run spit, a pass caught, a bus, a bus went back in. So I think we clean up 